Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello all, my name is Kivani Kija Indriyarti. I'm from 10 Science Life. The Honorable, my teacher, and my beloved friends, good morning. First of all, thank you for having me here in this fine and joyful morning. I hope we are all in the good health. Today, I will convey in the importance of education in my short speech. On many occasions, we hear the term education, but what is education? How is importance is education to our country and ourselves as students? Well, to answer the first question, education refers to a process by which a person develops their skill, attitudes, and values. Many times we associate this term with the school. However, we must also take into account that education is not exclusive to this institution, but also it is up to the family and even to the friendship with whom we live together day by day. That is why we can see that men can get to improve each other. There is a phrase that I like very much and I find it very true. If the people of a country care about the education, it shows that they love their nation. It is said that in order for a country to prosper, it needs education. But why? The honorable audiences. We study not to go to the graduation ceremony and hang our picture on the wall of our house, much less to show off to our friends. We study to practice and to acquire knowledge and those two then will prepare us to the real life situation. Education brings us to many benefits, such as confidence in ourselves, freedom to decide, conscience as a whole, help us to improve ourselves, to feel fulfilled, to feel that we are something in life and that we have an end for which to live. But this is not the only satisfaction that education gives us, but with it, we achieve a better quality of life. When we want to buy a dress, shoes, food, or anything else, we need to work, which currently is not so easy to find unless if we don't have an edu adequate education. It is said that the future of our country is in the hands of the children and as the children in this country, we must try hard to achieve that. That is why today I invite all the audiences here to reflect on the importance of education. We have to take advantage of these things to be able to go to school to study. We must appreciate the effort that our parents make to send us to school and think that there are many children who would like to study but for some reason they cannot do it. Finally, as ourselves, without effort and education, how do we want to improve ourselves? How do we want to live better? In a short, how do we want a better country? Therefore, education is an important part of our life as well as an essential part to develop a better future for the country. So this is the end of my speech today. I hope some of the points that I have conveyed today make us more appreciate of our chance to be able to have the education at school and make us to study more diligently for about our countries and our own future. Thank you for the attention. Good day. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.